What is the method of correct determination in each work? Verily, all deeds are according to their intention, and everyone gets what he intends. Important point. Know that sleeping, eating, working, and other lawful acts can be acts of obedience to Allah and means of nearness to Him. One can get a lot of reward for these activities when he intends to attain nearness to Allah while doing them. For example, if one goes to sleep early with the intention that he may wake up for Chiyamul Lail, then his sleep will become an act of worship. This is true for all legitimate jobs. Consolidation of many worships. Those who know how to use their time properly know how to use an opportunity to combine many acts of worship. Here are some examples. For example, when you go to the mosque to pray on foot or by car, this act itself is an act of worship. But similar time can be used for remembrance of Allah, recitation of Quran. As a result, many worships were combined using an opportunity. When you go to a walima so that no evil is done, that is an ibadah. But at the same time, you can call people to Allah and remember Allah. A woman staying at home doing household chores is an act of worship as she seeks nearness to Allah through it. At the same time, he can devote his time to other acts of worship by listening to Allah's zikr, Islamic lectures, etc. On the authority of Ibn Umar, Radi Allahu Ta'ala Anhu, who said, When we were in a meeting with the Messenger of Allah, may Allah bless him and grant him peace, we counted and he said a hundred times, Rabbi Firli Watub, Alaya Inaka Antat Tawabur Rahim, meaning, O oh Allah, forgive me and I return to you. Surely you are the most forgiving and the most merciful. Think about how the Prophet, may God bless him and grant him peace, used one opportunity to perform two acts of worship, remembering Allah and asking for his forgiveness, sitting with companions and teaching them religion, 